Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball Four TTMs autographs through the mail to show you guys. I've also got another pack of 2023 Bowman, and I also completed a trade on the trading card database for some TTM fuel and some PC cards. Um, as always, we'll start with TTM. The first one is from Parts Unknown. And we have got Steve Nicosia. He signed three of three in 12 days. He had a 248 batting average with 11 home runs, 88 RBIs. He played eight years. He appeared in 358 games. He played from 78 to 85. And he played with Pittsburgh, San Francisco, Montreal, and Toronto. And he was on a member of the 79 Pittsburgh Pirates World Series team. Steve Nicosia. All right, our second return is from Orlando, Florida. And we have got Chris Knapp. He signed three of three in 10 days. He had a career record of 36 and 32 with a 4.99 ERA. He played six years. He appeared in 122 games. He played from 75 to 80. He played with the White Sox and the Angels. Um, 1978 was his best year. And that year he went 14 and eight with a 4.21 ERA. Chris Knapp. All right, next up, I'm going to show you some uh, TTM fuel I got. Um, there's a total of 15 cards here. And all of these, except for the PC cards, um, are great signers. We have got Bill Sampin, Darren Reed, Ben McDonald. He is a PC card. As you all know, I PC uh, Ben McDonald and Brady Anderson. And then we've got Billy Bean. Don Robinson, Darren Reed again. Looks like he's catching flies right there. We got Ernie Witt, Don Robinson again, Chuck Rainey, Chris Zorich, Brady Anderson, PC, Chris Zorich again. We got another Brady Anderson. We've got a Rick Carlos, the barefoot kicker from the Broncos, and another PC card of Ben McDonald. So we got 11 cards I should be able to get signed, and four cards for the PC. All right, our next return comes to us from Charlotte, North Carolina. And we have got Ethan Horton. He signed 404 in nine days. During his career, he had 212 receptions for 2,360 yards. He also had 17 touchdowns. He played eight years. He appeared in 116 games. Um, he was a pro bowler in 1991. And that year he had 53 catches, 650 yards and five touchdowns. During his career, he played with Kansas City, Oakland, and Washington. Um, his rookie year, um, he played with Kansas City, 
and he was actually a running back his first year in the league. And he, uh, and he had he did have three rushing touchdowns that year. So total, Ethan Horton had 20 touchdowns in the NFL, and he has got a very nice signature, very legible. All right, before we get to our last return, we're gonna open up this pack of Bowman. And then after this pack of Bowman, we will have one pack left. And that is it. And then we're gonna start tearing in to those tops mega boxes. We're gonna start off with Brian Bello, Mark Bientos, Trey Turner, Wilson Contreras, we got Tatis Jr., Max Meyer. We have got Noel V. Marte, number 13. We got Yoriandi De Los Santos, Lazaro Montes, Christian Hernandez. Hey, I just got him signed um, the other day at the Wood Ducks game. Christian Hernandez, number nine prospect for Chicago Cubs. Then we got Logan Wagner and Alejandro Osuna. And that is it for that pack. All right, we got one more pack of Bowman and that's it. All right, our next return is from Metroplex, Michigan. And we have got Frank Tanana. He signed three of three in eight days. He had a record of 240 and 236 with a 3.66 ERA. He played 21 years, appeared in 638 games. He played from 73 to 93. And he played with California, Boston, Texas, Detroit, the Mets, and the Yankees. Um, he was a three-time All-Star. Um, in 1975, he led the league with 269 Ks. In 1976, uh, that was his first year as an All-Star. He went 19 and 10 with a 2.43 ERA. 1977, his second year went in, uh, being an All-Star. He went 15 and 9 with a 2.54 ERA, which he won the ERA title with that ERA. 77, his last year as an All-Star, or as I said in 78, he went 18 and 12 with a 3.65 ERA. So, and in 1977, not only did he win the ERA title, but he also led the league with seven shutouts. And during those years, 76 through 78, he finished in the top nine in the Cy Young voting each year. Frank Tanana. Solid pitcher for a long time. And that, guys, is going to do it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you've not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.